A horse is a horse, of course, of course, and no one can talk to a horse, of course. That is, of course, unless the horse is the famous Mr. Ed. Go right to the source and ask the horse. He'll give you the answer. All right, as we all sing along to that song, here we are at the Devon Horse Show and Country Fair. And Victoria and Lauren show you shows you all the extra fun that you can find here. But there is a lot of focus on the horses here and the crowd favorite, of course, the Clydesdales. Everybody wants to see them in action and they perform tonight, much to the delight of everyone here. We got to go behind the scenes to see what it takes to get them ready. Take a look. When it comes to drawing a crowd, they're really um, stunning, I guess. I like because they have braids in their hair. The world famous Budweiser Clydesdales are blue ribbon. They all have their individual personalities and uh, we get to know them and they're, they're fun to work with. Chris Weigert has been a handler for the Clydesdales for seven years. On Friday night, he took me behind the scenes to see how these horses prepare for their performance. So we have five people braiding uh, the horses to get them ready for the show tonight. Up next, the Clydesdales are brushed off and misted in fly spray. Does Ransom enjoy this whole process? Oh yeah, once we um, tie them up for braiding, they know it's showtime. Six-year-old Ransom is one of the strongest horses and one of the first to get harnessed with 130 pounds of leather and brass. You can just stand here next to them, okay. um, but you see now when they have their heads up and they're ready to show. Horse. <laughs> yeah, you really see the size of them. You can feel, I mean, that they're so powerful. Yeah, the horses weigh 2,000 pounds, but they can pull 4,000 pounds apiece. In all, eight Clydesdales are hitched up, and before long, they're marching to their big moment, bringing the crowd to its feet. Chris, Chris told me that they usually get the horses when they're about five years old, and then they'll work with them until they're about 15, and then they go off into horse retirement.